Hey up guys, Bravely and I here and welcome to episode number 12 of our Pokemon Ruby Retirement Lock series. Today we're starting off in Morville City once more. It'll be the last episode we start off in Morville. If you missed the last episode, please go and check that out before I spoil everything by showing you the team. Because a lot went down, a lot happened. Um, yeah, but we managed to beat Watson, the third gym leader. And um, yeah... It means that we've had some retirements. We also had some deaths. So, uh, yeah. Kind of sucked a little bit. But, um, we've had a grinding montage. And I got everybody up to level 21. Because I thought, well, Bubba Gump was already 21. So I thought, right, we'll get everybody on the same level. Uh, I think, like, the Pokemon that we fought on the route above were, like, late teens. So we are a tad over leveled, but it's okay. So, everybody's level 21. Uh, during the grinding, Boombox evolved into a Loudred. Uh, still holding the Silk Scarf. Still not that great stats wise, with Pound Up, Roar, Astonish, and Howl. Bubba Gump, the Gyarados, level 21, hasn't changed. Tackle Bite, Splash, and Rock Smash. We've got Bertha the Geodude level 21 with Magnitude, Defense Kill, Tackle, and Rock Throw. He's actually got decent stats. Bertha has actually got better stats than Loudred. So, yeah, that's a thing. Uh, Tracy evolved into an Azumarill. Tracy the Azumarill uh, with Tackle, Defense Kill, Tail Whip, and Water Gun. His stats are, her stats, sorry, are also, also awful, but he does have huge, she does have huge power. So, um... That doubles my attack to 46, so it's not so bad. If we could get some, like, Body Slam or something, that'd be great. Uh, we've got Vesuvius the Numa with, ta with Ember Tackle, Growl, and Magnitude. Vesuvius is pretty good. I quite like Vesuvius. It's not bad at all. Once he evolves, he'll be pretty damn good. And we've got Nia Jax the Makoita with Fake Out, Vital Throw, Sand Attack, and Arm Thrust. And Nia Jax is pretty good as well. I'm not to... Uh, not a problem there. Again, can't wait until Nia Jax evolves. So, today we're heading up Route 111. We already got an encounter up here. This is where Bertha came from. There's a Rock Smash encounter. So let's Rock Smash our way through here. And uh, we got an encounter here. We also got an encounter in Route 112. So, we've got this double battle here. Uh, a double battle which can pretty much be sorted out by using magnitude. So that's what I'm going to do. Oh, we've just spotted a tough looking trainer here of all places. Okay, roll camera, let's get this interview. And now that I'm sending these out, I realise that they do have a Magnemite and I'm sending out a Gyarados. So this is, this may be an issue. Do I think, do I really think? Doesn't fighting resist ground? I could go into Nia Jax. I could go into Nia Jax. No, I, th I don't think it's, I, I don't think it's going to. I'll bite it just in case, try and flinch it. Oh, it doesn't matter, we outspeed. Magnitude 6, that's killing the Magnemite. It's not killing the Wasteman, but it's killing the Magnemite. See you later. Oh, what I didn't do is check my items. Should probably do that. Ooh, it nearly did kill the Wasteman. It nearly did kill the Wasteman. Sets for hell. I didn't check my items. Should probably do that. We haven't got the experience share on anybody because uh, we don't need it on anybody. We don't want to give an interview. We don't want to give an interview. Go away. Those guys are good training though in the future. Let's see. Let's. Oh no 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 no. Right. So we've got paralyzed heals. Uh, we've got 15 super potions. Let's get them towards the top. Uh, swap them with this attack. 
And uh, we've got a HP up there, so let's use that. Who's got the high? Yeah, Tracy's got pretty good HP. Tracy's HP stats is best stat, so I'm going to give it to Tracy. Okay, Route 112. We also already got an encounter on. So let's um, let's head in here with the uh, with Bertha out front. I want to use Bertha a bit. I like I like Geodudes, and obviously level 21. We're close to a Graveler at level 25. We won't be able to evolve past that. Because I don't think I run this ROM through the randomizer to try and do that. I was going to, but I think I forgot. Zigzagoon goes down without an issue. What else we got? A Nuzleaf. Nope. We're not battling a Nuzleaf. Uh, we're going to Nia Jax. It's probably going to fake out. If it's got any sense, it'll fake out. Oh, it nature powers. Did a lot of damage. Um, so I'm going to fake out. And then I'm going to arm thrust. I should use Vatalfur, actually. Vatalfur is a good move. It's a really good move. But it's, uh, it makes you go second. Like, you don't have a choice in the matter. You have to go second. So, but, it, but I don't think he can miss. So, he swings and roundabouts, I guess. I don't think I got all the items off our dead Pokemon. I'm still gutted about losing those Pokemon, by the way. Uh, Ralph and Fernando. Uh, I'm pretty devastated that we lost those. Through death, anyway. I'm also devastated that we lost Rage. Because... I really wanted to use a Breloom. Really wanted to use a Breloom. I mean, I, I couldn't really... I don't really care about Tentacool. But I really wanted to use a Breloom. Nope. <laughs> Once again, all the nope. Uh, what do we go into to combat this? We're so going into Boombox. They like nature power. Nature power did a lot of damage. I don't want to go into uproar until I can be sure that it'll kill. Which it should kill now if I go if I use uproar. There we go. Oh, I've also forgot we've got Shockwave to teach somebody. That's what I was going to do at the start of this episode. We've got Shockwave. At the end of last episode. Oh, during grinding, I also went and got the Strength HM. Oh, only Boombox can learn it. Is there... Is that really worth... Everybody can learn Strength. Strength might be a good one to teach. I'm going to teach you to Boombox, because it's Stab. So, that's pretty good. It's, a, it's much better than Pound. It's like twice the power of a pound. So stab with the silk scarf? Yes. Uh, I'm also going to teach it to Tracy. For that, um... That huge power boost. Uh, we'll get rid of Tail Whip for it. Uh, is, uh, is Shockwave going to do much damage off Boombox? Oh, I can't use strength yet. 31 special attack. It's not bad special attack. It might be worth it just for any water types. We don't really have anything for water types anymore. We did have. Both of them have gone now. This lock. This lock. Eh, yeah, I'll get rid of Astonish. I like Shockwave. It's a good move. It's a good move. I'm going to go in against this guy. He's probably got Geodudes. And if he has got Geodudes, I may not stay in. Yeah, he has. He's level 16 as well, so that means he has got Magnitude. So, let's not. I'm going to Tracy. 
There we go. There's the magnitude. Magnitude 6. How much is it going to do? Not a whole lot. The magnitude 6 probably wouldn't have done all that much to... Uh, to Bertha anyway. Because Bertha has got really high defense. So I wouldn't have thought it would have done too much. But you never know. This guy's just sitting here with his rocks. He's just training rocks. It's still so hot, by the way, in England. Uh, I think I complained about it last episode, last two episodes. I think it was the Ruby retirement lot where I was wearing my vest when I recorded. It was so hot. It's cooled down a little bit, but it is still really hot. Like... The thing is, like, people from the UK are not equipped to deal with heat. Like, our temperatures, you know, the, anybody from, like, Australia or whatever will be looking at me thinking, You what, mate? It's 30 degrees. Like, you gotta be joking, mate. We normally have it about 45. Yeah, we don't, we, we're not equipped for this. We're used to it being a, a nice, solid 16 degrees. It, it, it's a maximum temperature. Okay, so we're in, we're coming up to is it uh, fiery caverns? Is it called? Fiery caverns is a new encounter. So we're going to get that. Uh, we already have a normal. And we already have, I think you can get Geodudes in there. So we've already got those two. So I'm pretty sure it means we get, we're get we getting a Slugma or a Torkoal in here. And Torkoal's a rare encounter. Oh, we're getting nothing. Oh, there we go. First encounter in Fiery Caverns is a Torkoal. It's a rare encounter, but we got one. Torkoal's nice, because Torkoal's got really good defense. It can definitely live a strength. It can live another. Alright, don't don't poison me. Don't poison me. Thank you. Smoke screen, that's fine. I'm throwing balls. I'm throwing bowels. Uh, let's try Pokeballs. Can't really do much to me, so... Ah, uh, no. Ah, it burns me. Um, let's just go into Bertha. Sort out that burn afterwards. I'm pretty sure I'm, I must have a berry or something to cure burn. Right, Torkoal. Torkoal digs through the mountains in search of coal. If it finds some, it fills hollow spaces on its shell with the coal and burns it. If it attacks, if it is attacked, this Pokemon spouts thick black smoke to beat a retreat. So what do we name a Torkoal? Um. Fiery turtle. A fiery turtle. What do you even uh, I don't know. I'm gonna he's a, he's a female. I'm gonna name it Denise. Know why? Don't know why it's Denise. Denise the Torkoal is here. Right, we must have a. I think it's Rawsberry that heals burn. Yeah.
And we get two more raspberries. I thought they were outside here as well, so. Just run past these patchy berries. And raspberries. Thank you. Right. Uh, this is route 12 again. Route 112. Correct? Still route 112. Yes. Route 111. Oh, so it's the same route. Uh, and does this classify as a new area? It doesn't classify as a new area, you know. It doesn't seem to classify as a new area, which sucks. So when we get the go goggles, we're not gonna we're not getting an encounter in the desert, which really sucks because I really wanted like a catnia, but Sandshrew would have been nice as well. We're gonna go out to Vesuvius. Yeah, you can't de-wave me. Magnitude. Everything that we've got like uses magnitude on things. It's great. You know, it's so hot to be wearing headphones, man. So hot to be wearing headphones. I ain't used to this. Whalemer. Nope. Uh, how do we even deal with a whalemer? We've got a shockwave on boombox, but it's pretty low HP. It's not completely low, though, is it? Well, I don't think whalemer could take me out. I don't think whalemer could take me out. What's his best move going to be? Water gun? Yeah, that's super potion. Because a crit might not kill. But if it happened to have water pulse, a crit of that would definitely kill. Okay, we do two shot, so that's nice. Boom, boom, boom. Why does he have to have Pokemon that beat the Pokemon that I've got out? Why is that a thing? We're going to Bubba Gum. We are going into Bubba Gum. Bubba Gum, Bubba Gum, Bubba Gum. Bubba Gum. Bubba gum, bubba gum, bubba bubba bubba. No, I can't do it. I can't get my lips around it. Nah, we're gonna miss tackles now. Sand attack shouldn't have fat flying types. Should have sorted that. Battlefield's gonna do nothing. I'm not, I'm not scared of this Makuita. It can't do anything to me. Super Potion. And it heals it full. That's just irritating. You're just an annoyance. I'm sorry for the speed up, but... We are at, like, minus six. We managed to take down Cool Trainer Wilton. And let's see. What's that? What am I doing? I'm thinking about making my own room here using a Pokemon move. I know I'll give you this TM. Won't you use it to make your own room? I won't. But I will use it to kill things. Secret Power is a pretty good move. I like that it gets different um, statuses and stuff. And it's base 70 move. So. It's a base 70 move. So what can everything can learn secret power as well, I think. Yeah, base 70. Anything can learn it. Might give it boom box again. Just give it a like, little bit of alternative to strength. Also, it's better than uproar. It's stronger than uproar and it doesn't lock you in. So yeah, we're gonna we're gonna get rid of uproar. Uproar's good. Good move, but 
it locks you in. I don't like that in a Nuzlocke. Don't really like that. I'm going to go and chat to this lady. Why don't you just put her on the other side so that you can just run in and heal? You don't have to concentrate on what you're doing. And she never wants to wants you to leave. She's like really weird. Get out of there fast, man. I already healed my Pokemon. You want me to uh, to be sticking around? Meow. There's uh, a trainer down here. I think there's an item somewhere as well. Maybe not. I'm gonna say there's one here though. Nope. Alright. Daisuke. Bringing out a matchup. Alright. We're going to have to swap Tracy out from the front in a sec as well. Although there is a... There's a chip with a numeral knocking around, isn't there? And I know that there's... There's this woman with a numeral coming up. So, we shall keep, him out, keep her out for the numeral. And then we'll swap her out from front. Not really worried about the next gym unless something pretty major happens. We've got the we've got three Pokemon that can deal with the gym leader. We've got three Pokemon that can deal with fire types. So we've got Numel, we've got Azumarill, and um, Geodude. So not really scared of the next gym leader. Just scared of getting scared of the retirements, you know. Oh, and we've got Bubba Gump. But Bubba, blah, blah, Bubba Gump doesn't have a water move. But I'm scared of the retirements. I'm also... Because um, I don't want Makuita to be retired. Because then obviously we've got the normal type gym afterwards. Straight after. So, we've got a Wingle here. I thought this chick had a new more. Hi, can't supersonic me. I'm the gingerbread man. What? Shockwave. She does have a new more. Typically sends it out when I'm already not in Tracy, but, you know. No, I guess the burn. I know we picked up them raspberries, and it doesn't affect our water gun power, but still. It's unnecessary. We don't need to use the raspberries, because we can just run back to that lady. She didn't want us to leave, we're just going to keep going back. Nice one, Boombox. Leveling up. Don't know what level Boombox will evolve. Hmm. What level does Boombox evolve? I think I've seen 30s. Early 30s. Okay, you can stop this. I also don't know when Numel evolves. I feel like that's early 30s as well. Hmm. It's them growths. Them growths. Gotta go into Bubba Gump. Bubba Gump will outspeed. If he uses growth here, I'm not going to be happy. Super potion. Could have. We could have ambered. See, this Roselia has got Mega Drain, so that makes growth a little bit more scary than when I had growth and absorb. But we just flinched it out. <laughs> Bubba Gump doesn't care. I want to put a King's Rock on Bubba Gump. I really want to put a King's Rock on Bubba Gump. 
because I'm flinching so much as it is. My Pokemon are exhausted, thank you. Thank you for healing them up for me. No, 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 no. You haven't even got a bed. Where did I sleep? Where did I sleep? Okay, let's get on the bike. Route 113. So, first encounter in Route 113 is... Sandshrew! Okay. I can get behind that. I can get behind that. We're going to tackle. No way tackle's going to kill. Probably could have lived to strength, actually, but not going to risk it. Uh, I'm not going to risk another one, either. My luck with critting our encounters this playthrough has been pretty bad, so. I can get behind a Sandshrew. I like Sandshrew. Um, Sandshrew will be able to learn strength for a good, good move straight away. Um, and then, I don't know what his moveset will be like. Sandshrew's um, well known for having terrible moveset. Oh, I didn't really um, look at that. Uh, I'm, I'm, it's, it's a very stereotypical name. For Sandshrew. Well, for Sandslash. But Sandslash looks like Super Saiyan 3 Goku, so he's going to be called Goku. Yeah, I'm not really bothered about seeing where I walked, man. Pretty, pretty sad. Trap inch. Yeah, well, we'll stick out with Tracy, I guess. <laughs> Once it gets to level 24, we'll swap her out from the front. Get some, to so get somebody else some experience. There we go, level 24. Trying to learn Bubble Beam. That's a good reason to get me to level 24. And let's get rid of Defense Kill. We don't need it, do we? Lanoon. Hey, uh, we're going to swap out into Nia Jax. I'm just hoping that we don't take too much damage. Tail Whip. Okay. I should have faked out then. Oh, come on. Come on, Vital Throw. Come on. Come on, Nia Jax. Oh, nearly. Nearly. If I had to use Faker, I would have killed. Mm. Problem with Nia Jax is she's so slow. And Makuita is. Sorry, Naya. Fully aware that Naya Jax could actually kill me. Fully aware. I said I was going to put swap Tracy out from the front, didn't I? And I didn't. And let's go with... I'm going to go with Vesuvius. There's a bunch of ninja boys around here. They've got bug types, I'm guessing. So Vesuvius will be able to take him out. Coughing. Coughing is going to have levitate, isn't it? I would love to just magnitude this thing into another dad. No! Two self-destructs so far in this playthrough. Two self-destructs so far in this playthrough.
I'm sad. I really wanted to use Numel. Haven't used a Numel in a long, long time in a playthrough. Well, I've never used one in a playthrough, sorry. It, like, in a, in a playthrough of, like, and before I did YouTube. I haven't used a Numel in a long, long time. This guy is just a troll master. Four coughings about the all no self destruct. I'm not about that life, man. Oh. Vesuvius! Such a powerful name as well. Such a powerful name. Uh, I'm sad. I am sad. I am the sad. Sucks. Oh man. And it's getting hotter now. You know what? It is actually getting hotter. Um, I'm just uh, I'm, I'm just looking at the time that we've been recording and thinking, do I really need to battle this girl? I guess we're battling her. We are after this battle. I am gonna end the episode off. I'm gonna end it off in the middle of the route, and uh, we'll uh, we'll continue our journey onto. Is it Falabra Town? Yeah, it is. It's Falabra Town. Uh, in the next episode. Here's the girl with the Numel. I knew there was one. Sets up the sunny day. You don't need to do that. It's sunny enough outside. I am roasting. No need. See you later, Numel. Good experience for Nia Jack, sir. Alright, we're going to leave this episode off here. Thank you for watching. I hope you have enjoyed this episode of the Pokemon Ruby Retirement Lock. And uh, next episode, we will be going to the Full Arbor Town and making our way down south to Meteor Falls and seeing what's cracking off there. Thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope you have enjoyed it, and I will see you next time. Stay brave, guys. How will I sit in silence? How will I be denied? I was not born to fall. I was not born